More local news now. A Shorewood man opens up his garage door to find his car missing. Somehow, someone was able to get in there without him noticing last night. Ricky Mitchell live in Shorewood after speaking to this victim. Ricky. Julia, that man says that he and his wife just moved into their Shorewood home from downtown and they had barely started unpacking all of their boxes when someone stole their car right out of the garage. Could have been a lot worse, I guess, but but very scary still. Zach, who asked us to conceal his identity, says he and his wife weren't able to sleep last night after dealing with this brazen crime so soon after moving into their new house. We were uh, downtown having went to a plane, went to dinner and came back and and uh, noticed that the, the back door was open. According to police, the thief or thieves broke through the back door of the home and then used a garage door opener they found to break into the couple's detached garage, taking Zach's Dodge Charger. Obviously, we moved to you know to Shorewood, thinking you know that it's it's one of the safer safer neighborhoods, and you know the folks in our neighborhood, our neighbors have been here for you know 20, 30, 40 years, some of them. So I think everybody, you know, from talking to them this morning. You know, the neighborhood's pretty, pretty shaken by it. Especially after a carjacking took place just a block west of Zach's home three weeks ago. Police say in that incident, three men stole a car at gunpoint. In Zach's case, he says police were able to lift fingerprints, and he hopes that helps police find them. Our keys were not in the car. All the doors were locked, um, and it still happened. You know, we have lights on, the porch lights on automatically at night, and, and, um, you know, it still happens, so I think just got to be vigilant and um, you know, do what you can to keep yourself safe. And Shorewood police also investigated a recent incident where two men assaulted a 19-year-old woman and stole her purse. That happened just half a mile from this police station. In Shorewood, Ricky Mitchell, today's TMJ4. Ricky, thank you.